Yasmina is a very energetic girl. She's so much into sport. Uh, she loves being around, running, uh, and one of her favorite uh, uh, hobby is actually horseback riding. So I was on a forest ride and then we were supposed to gallop up a hill. Um, it was a little bit new for me to gallop up a hill, so uh, it was the first time I went. I don't know what happened, my horse got scared and I flew off. Her dad was so much panicking. I was trying to calm him down only because I didn't want someone to touch her. And I was really very scared of anything that might happen to her. Uh, and then I told my husband to come directly to City Hospital because I've been hospitalized here twice and, and I really like the treatment that I had. So yeah, I, I felt pain. I was like terrified. Uh, so since it was the first time, I was worried. I was panicking and I was like, I'm never going to go on my horse again. Mama, I'm scared. I think it was the longest two, two hours of my life wasn't passing but uh, we've received a full support from the hospital uh, the nurses keep on updating us on what's happening what's going to be done a lot of people that i know and other people know when this happens to them they don't repeat the thing that hurt them but it's not going to stop me to go back on my horse i must say when i saw her after three hours of her surgery on her crutches with her physiotherapist and Dr. Murad like really walking, it was like, wow, this is gonna pass and this shall pass. And then uh, we, I think she went back to school after two weeks. She was fine with her implant and everything that happened. She was able to do it mentally and physically. And she proved that she could do it and I'm so proud of her with the full team, with the full support from the nurses to everyone in the hospital. I'm only grateful for everything that they've done in order to ensure that she's in a good shape today. So thank you so much. We received Yasmina in our ME department after she fell from a horse. She sustained severe pain and deformity of her right leg. After the clinical assessment, X-ray and CT scan confirmed fracture neck of femur, which was displaced in her right hip. This type of injury is unique simply because it interferes with the blood supply to the femoral head and also there is a chance to disturb the growth of the proximal part of the femur. So we had to prepare her urgently for an operation in the same night where special plate and screws was arranged and fixed to fix the fracture. The unique thing in this kind of fracture is that the fracture line is very near to the growing end and the special plate and screws meant to reduce this fracture and hold it in a place till uh, the bone heals. Um, fortunately, um, the fracture healed nicely with no consequences in the blood supply uh, of the femoral head and all the metal removed last week and she's doing extremely well. She's back to her normal daily activity and we confirmed that um, in the future there won't be any dysfunction in her uh, right hip functions. Thank you.